welcome to Ridge Life. Welcome to Ramblings. How is everyone doing on this it's fine good. Friday good. morning? Uh, Sonya's trying to tell me I'm speeding a little bit. She's just making sure I know the speed limit, all right? That's all she's doing. Thank you, Sonya. I appreciate you. I just left the planning commission, the county planning commission. I turned in my septic permit. Got that paid for and done. Turned in my septic permit. And then I uh, uh, also turned in my Honest Abe Log Home Timber Frame drawing package. Now it's just a preliminary drawing package. It shows the square foot, square footage and the room layouts and all that stuff. And I asked the lady, um, would those drawings suffice for permit application? And she, she gave me a, a piece of paper with everything that's required. And I was reading through it and uh, you gotta have more on it than I've got all my drawings. You gotta have, let me see if I can find it here. This is the wrong one. Hold on one second. I am driving here, guys. So, um, you got to have, uh, uh, you must have your, may have to have a engineered documents. Now my drawings are gonna be engineered from Honest Abe, okay? One thing they did add, I saw, you remember I'm having a solar house? Uh, they ha Starting in October of last year, they are requiring you have building permit for all exterior buildings greater than 400 square feet. Um, now, my solar house is not gonna be 20 by 20. I'm gonna make sure it's not 20 by 20. I have to be smaller than 20 by 20. Um, any drop-in building you don't need it or any building less than 400 square feet. Now my barn I'm building is 36 by 40, but it's agricultural, okay? It is not, an, it's not a accessory building to a house. It's, it's, it's agricultural. So it does not require, does not require, okay. Um, but what they said here, what they said here, I do not have on mine, is you've gotta have where all the seismic straps and panels are, you've gotta show the attic ventilation on your drawings, you gotta show the crawl space ventilation on your drawings, if you've got a crawl space, which I do, and you also have to show where the water heater is located and it's a 50 foot max distance on hot water lines, 50 foot max distance on hot water lines. So I got a 40 by 40 house, um, barnuminium. The hot water here is gonna be the outside, so I gotta make sure diagonally, I don't have more than 50 feet. Well, there you go. I, my drawings that I, I submitted today will not suffice for building permit. So I've got to get back with Honest Abe Log Home and see where we're at on my next step. You know, I've, I've, I've pretty much approved these initial drawings with the window layout and all that stuff. We still are trying to iron out, you know, window types and all that stuff. But I've got to get drawings that show those things so I can get my building permit. I can't get the foundation going until I've got the building permit. And I also got to pay uh, taxes and all that per building permit fees and all that stuff. Oh my gosh, guys. If you can live, not live in a county that requires building permits, man, move now, right? If you haven't built yet and you're not set on where you're going to be, move to uh, places like where Come on Homestead and Simple Life of Claim Country Road, Cure DD5 and Junk to Gyms and Bobblehead. Move, move, move out there because they got it going on. Here, uh, I've already told you about my solar, right? You know, uh, they're gonna require engineered documents and all that stuff. Um, you know, I, I'm a professional electrician of 30 years. Uh, I, I know what I'm doing. Now, I'm not done residential, but I have design systems and uh, power systems and control systems and all that. Um, so yeah, I don't know all the residential codes and stuff, which I'll, I'll get assistance you know, I think I've told you before from a, a local electrical contractor, I'll get assistance on making sure I'm doing residential code and county code and all that, state code. Um, but yeah, so my drawings, not good enough. 
were not good enough. Uh, but I do have the, se I did get the septic permit submitted. Ding! One step, one step closer, guys. One step closer to off grid. Um, but what I can do is I can build my barn. I can clear the land. I can put my carport solar panel house up. I can put my solar house up. And I may even be able to get the well. I see, yeah, I don't think you're supposed to do the well and the septic. I got the septic permit. I don't want to push it. That's just, isn't that sad? Isn't that sad? I'm saying I don't want to push it. I should be able to do it. Yeah. <laughs> It is, it is frustrating. It, it, it is frustrating. Um, but to remedy that, I'm going to the gym. I'm doing, a, uh, I told you I, I reduced my physical therapy down from uh, three days a week to two days a week. Uh, cost was just outrageous, but they're worth it. They're awesome. Uh, Megan and uh, Leah up there uh, at Campbell Clinic, top notch. Ladies, top notch. Um, but now I'm going to the gym every day. Uh, I go to the gym every day that I don't go to PT. So I'm going to go start going to the gym, you know, uh, at least uh, the three days a week that I don't go to the PT. That's five days a week. And I'm going to go on some, uh, weekends too when Jin Jin's here. So um, going to be getting fit. <sighs> going to be getting fit. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go to the gym and start uh, bending this knee every which way but loose in any which way you can. Y'all remember those movies? Who starred in them? Who starred in Every Which Way But Loose and Any Which Way You Can? I think there was a third one, too. Love those movies. Love those movies. <laughs> tell, me, tell me down below, who starred in Every Which Way But Loose and Any Which Way You Can? Good stuff. Good stuff. Um, yeah, so... Uh, Today is Friday. Jen Jen has to work tomorrow. So I'm hoping she gets to come over after her long day at work. And uh, some of y'all were saying, Tim, you're giving out way too much information on where your girlfriend lives and work. Okay. Um, I've said many times, you know, she lives in eastern Arkansas and in the, in, the, in the city she lives in. It's a city, you know. It's not like I gave you the street number. Or, you know, house color or address or anything. And I said she works at a hospital. You know, um, a lot of people work at a hospital. And uh, as far as the hours she works, you know, they vary. They vary. Um, and, and most information you can find online. I mean, there, there's crazies out there, I know. Um, so, yes, I need to protect my girlfriend. I know, I understand. Um, and uh, if you think I, you think I'm giving out too much information, you know, you can leave me a comment down below. Um, but guys, you know, I, this is Ridge Life Ramblings. I ramble, and I probably say more more things than I should. And uh, y'all are pretty used to me. Y'all pretty used to me. Um, lots going on today, guys. Today is Friday. Um, at four o'clock. At four o'clock, I believe. David from Come On Homestead is having a premiere. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. At 4 p.m. Friday evening, Dave is having a premiere of some massive work going on on Come On Mountain. A big old giant Widowmaker tree coming down, a bunch of other things. Then at 5 p.m., I believe Anthony from Country Road Cure and Roxanne are going live. Again, correct me if I'm wrong. And then at 6, DD5. That would be Mike and Lissa have a massive premiere. Well, oh, well, I mean, it's long, okay? And it, it, it is a motion picture, as David said. It is a long one, okay? And it's epic. Uh, them getting uh, uh, their dogs kennel and all those, all, you know, the, 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 the digging of the, you know, the rock holes. That's the, you know, they got rock holes. Gonna be good, gonna be good. I may, I may, if I can get done, I may end up having a premiere at 8 p.m. That gives them time to, you know, and gives you all enough time to get some dinner eaten and everything after their premiere. I may have a premiere at 8 p.m. 
of the last of the princess trip. That would be uh, me, my daughter, which is my princess, and Adelie, which is her princess and my princess also. We went to Florida, you know, last fall, and uh, we had a wonderful time. You've seen the Magic Kingdom video. You've seen the Animal, Animal Kingdom video. Well, this video that I finished tonight, today, is for all Star Wars fans. This was my day, right? Magic Kingdom was uh, uh, Adelie's day, right? Uh, Animal Kingdom was Alyssa's day. She loved uh, oh the uh, Everest expedition. Everest, I loved it too. So did so Adley. But today, but this one, Hollywood Studios, was Paw Paw's day. It is Star Wars extravaganza. And if you like Star Wars and you've never been to Hollywood Studios, or at least haven't recently been to Hollywood Studios and seen the Rise of the Resistance ride, and they got Smuggler's Run. And uh, so, you know, of course, you have the Tower of Terror and uh, Rock and Roll road Roller Coaster. Uh, and they got the new Toy Story area, the Toy Story Roller Coaster, and and Buzz Lightyear. No, that was at Magic Kingdom. Um, they have uh, anyway. If you like, and you've never been, the video I'm going to have premiere of, you can experience it with me. I I use my GoPro. Um, there is a brown recluse. What? There's a brown recluse on my window. That is crazy. I can't turn it around. My, my. Come on, get the old, get the wind, blow it off. There's a brown recluse. <laughs> it's a brown recluse. I hate spiders. Get off there. I'm afraid. It's right on my window, and when I open my door, it's gonna fall down on me. <laughs> oh, it scared me to death. Don't do that. Don't do that. I don't see it anymore. Oh, now I do see it. It's still up there. Oh, no. All right. It's better to see a spider than not see a spider and know it's there, right? All right. Um, Star Wars. Um, it, it, you get firsthand experience of, of riding the rides, um, GoPro style, uh, not heavily edited, you know, as far as, you know, uh, all kinds of, you know, it's, 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 it's a vacation video. And I don't know if most of you do not like vacation videos. I understand that. I understand that. Uh, but you do get to see Ridge Life. Uh, and this is Ridge Life Life. You know, that's why it's Ridge Life. Um, it's not just the Ridge videos. It's Ridge Life. Uh, and you get to see Adelie. And you get to see Alyssa. And then you get to see again. If you love Star Wars. If you love Star Wars, you're going to want to watch. Spider's still there. You're going to you're gonna watch tonight's video. If I, if I can get it out tonight. So be on the lookout for a uh, Ridge Life premiere of Hollywood Studios. The Force is with me. That's right. The Force is with me. The Force is with me. Uh, all right, guys. Uh, let's see how I'm doing on time. I'm, I'll, I'll wait till we get up to the gym. Uh, I spoke to David. He kind of a little perturbed at me. David from Come On Homestead. He said, did you tell people about the beard comment? I said, yeah, I did. I said, if you would have deleted that comment, I would have known you didn't want to talk about that comment. But the fact that you you left it in, left the comments in there and you responded, I thought, hey, it's public. I can talk about it. He said, I can't tell you nothing. I said, of course you can. You can always tell me something. And if you don't want me to tell something, just, you know, say, don't, don't, don't say this. I will never say it. Uh, and there's some things he tells me that I just know I can't say, okay? And that's, just, that's just the bro code, right? But this wasn't the bro code. This was someone saying I had a better beard than him. <laughs> I thought that was funny. I thought that was funny. I mean, it's not true. Of course not. He, you know, his beard is is different. He, you know, each dude is different. Someone Actually, someone commented on my video that, you know, uh, you can't comment on a du dude's beard, you know? Uh, each, each bro is different. Bros don't do that. Bros don't do that. Um, yeah, so it was funny though. You all, y'all left some really funny comments. He he called me. Had he had his little violin strings. Uh, just a he was he was whining just a little bit. Why? <laughs> Oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. All right, I'm still scared of the spider. Oh, I can't see the spider. It's gone. I don't know where it's at. <laughs> I'm so scared. See, y'all can make fun of me. I'm scared of spiders. I don't know where it's at. It's a proper recluse. <laughs> All 
<laughs> All right, guys. I'm gonna get in this gym right here and work out this knee. It it is it needs some loosening up. So, guys, until next time. Hope everyone has a blessed, blessed day. Keep rambling and go ridge life.